this is my 39 week pregnancy update. So today technically I'm 39 and a half weeks. Um, I had my appointment this past Monday, so when I was 38 and a half weeks. And I had good blood pressure at the appointment, so we were all happy about this because we were a little, like, meh, not so happy that had gone up. But it went back down, so that's a sign that I'm not, like, having signs for preeclampsia. Uh, my blood pressures were 100 over 80 and 112 over 72. So the midwives were really happy about this. Chris was really happy. Like, we all felt better. Um, the baby was measuring at 40 centimeters, so um, that was like last time I was measuring at 38 and a half, and this time I measured at 40, so it grew like one and a half, possibly. So we're happy about this. They took my blood again just to be safe, and we didn't hear anything back, which she said we were not going to like call you and tell you, we'll only call you and tell you if like there's something that you need to be concerned about. So I'm assuming that was good because we didn't hear anything back. Um, and we have our appointment tomorrow. So we'll see um, what we're measuring at tomorrow. And tomorrow will be my 39 and a half week appointment. Um, so we'll see what the midwife says tomorrow, but should still all look good. Um, what else? I don't feel like I'm going into labor anytime soon. Um, like I haven't had any major changes or anything happen where I'm like, oh, I had a contraction and now I'm gonna go into labor in the next couple days. I still don't think I've had a contraction yet. Everybody says you'll know when you have a contraction when you have to like breathe through it and that hasn't happened yet. So I'm four days away from my due date. Um, so I don't think that it'll be coming early. But who knows? We'll see. Um, I definitely feel like ginormous and uncomfortable and like getting out of the bed is getting to be kind of like painful, like trying to sit up. It's like, ouch, down in my lower abs, what used to be abs. Um, yeah, I don't have to pee more than usual, really. So it's not like, I mean, I feel like it got lower, but I don't know like if it's where it needs to be to go into labor. Um, so yeah, I've had like the past 10 days off work, so we did a lot of like cleaning and tidying. I don't really like, I don't know, if I still feel like it never is ending. Like I could always be cleaning and like doing laundry and stuff, but we got stuff organized for the when the baby comes, we kind of rearranged some things so it looks better and more organized for the kid. Um, we packed all of our bags. So my bag, Chris's bag, and the baby's bag are all ready to go if I was to go into labor anytime soon. And what else? We, fit, we made a birth plan, which we've been asking, like the midwives have been asking us to do this for like weeks now. So we actually made the birth plan, wrote it out. So we have it in the bag for when we go there or if we get transferred or anything, which hopefully we don't. Um, I did the forms for the birth certificate. So it'll have a birth certificate. And a social security number, which is good. And let's see. <clears throat> I think that's about all. We're just kind of waiting for it to come. And everybody's like, how are you feeling? Checking in and stuff. And I feel fine. Like, I just feel really big and overweight. And just waiting for whenever this little thing girl or boy is ready to come out so I want it to keep growing and get as big and chunky as possible um, even though I'm uncomfortable like I'm in no rush for it to like come out so I haven't started doing any like start doing a million stairs and eating all this weird stuff I haven't started doing any of that stuff because I'm really fine with it staying in there until whenever it's ready like <clears throat> the only time I will probably start to do that stuff is if I start to get close to 42 weeks because I really don't want to have to go and have labor in a hospital. Like, I really love this birth center and I want to deliver there. And they said once I go past 42 weeks that I can't. So probably I'll start to do stuff if I get anywhere close to 41 weeks. But other than that, I'm just going to chill out and let this little bean come whenever it wants. So that's all I think. If I missed anything, 
or if you guys have questions leave comments below and I will answer them because I feel like that was pretty quick but nothing really changed just still growing so we will now do a belly shot alrighty here we are 39 weeks from the side 39 weeks from the front and 39 weeks from the other side. Why are you making that face? Time? Oh gosh. Looks like I got some abs today. <laughs> side abs. Yeah, side abs. All right, thanks for watching. Let it level out. Mm -hmm. This is what hypnobirth practicing looks like. Just kissing, moving very slowly, breathing very deeply and listening to it. <laughs>